Well, not the only place, though, people had uh, a chance to flock to to watch the eclipse. Yeah, Chief Meteorologist Mark Johnson is in Menor, where he and so many others watched that fabulous celestial event. It was so fun to listen to you and meteorologist Katie McGraw, Mark, during totality. I forgot something today. It was sunscreen. Can you tell? A I feel lozenge. like I got a little sunburn. <laughs> yeah. That was a lozenge. Yeah, I'm losing my voice. Sorry. What an incredible experience. And I want to just give you a few. I want to just let you know kind of what we saw as we went into totality. We all saw it go into totality. And then we saw the aura of the sun's corona, uh, the corona sphere around the sun and around that moon shadow there. But we also at the very bottom saw a little red flare. OK, that's called a prominence. That's a burst of hot gases like a solar flare that's caught in the magnetic field of the sun. So it kind of curls down and then back into the sun. We see them all the time when we see live video of the sun. But when you see it during an eclipse, it appears as this little red dot on the outer edge of the moon. And we saw that today. Pretty rare stuff. And then, of course, we saw two, not one, but two of the diamond ring effects as we went into totality and came out. So just an incredible experience. Hopefully you enjoyed it live from Mentor. We certainly did. I'm going to keep my voice going and give you a very rainy but mild <laughs> forecast coming up.